Hi Facebook Church. It's May 3rd, but I didn't do the devotional for yesterday for May 2nd. I just got my nails done. We're gonna do Faith Food Devotions, Kenneth e. Hagen. And we'll do May 2nd. And this is I'm doing cold turkey. I haven't read it yet. <laughs> okay. So it's called Saving the Lost. Second Peter 3 9. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise, as some men count slackness, but is long suffering to usward, not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. We know, Kenneth, H Kenneth Hagin says, we know that saying, saving the lost is God's will, because it was to save the lost that Jesus laid down his life. Therefore, knowing this, we, we would not pray, God save my mother if it's your will. Don't let her go to hell if it is your will. If it's not your will, let her go to hell. <laughs> no. Why? Because we know God's will in the matter. God's will, his word, makes it clear in such scriptures as John 3.16 and 2 Peter 3.9. It is God's will for men and women to be saved, to, and therefore we can pray for the lost with great boldness. Believers especially can exercise great authority in praying for the salvation of their families. I used some of the scriptures we've been studying as I prayed for my relatives. I said something like this, this is the confidence that we have in God that if we ask anything according to his will, he hears us. What am I saying for is according to God's will, therefore he hears me. This is what the word says. And if we know that he hears us whatsoever we ask, we know that we have the petitions that we desire of him. Then according to the word, I have that petition. Then I stopped asking and started thanking God. It's amazing how it works. I don't mean that your entire family will necessarily come to the Lord overnight, but as you stand in faith thanking God, they will come. So our confession today, I'll say it once and then I'll say it again so you can repeat it out loud with me if you wish. I can pray in faith for the lost. I can pray in faith for the lost because I know God's will in the matter, because I know God's will in the matter. Okay, in the matter, yes. So thank you, Jesus. We thank you that all of our family, all of our loved ones, our whole household will be saved and have eternal life in heaven with us. And we thank you for that now, Lord, that you hear the petitions. We're praying according to your will and you hear us and you will do it and we thank you lord that our families are safe in your hands thank you jesus amen god bless you and have a beautiful rest of your day in jesus aloha